Kitsune coming at you from hookapro.com. Um, today we are doing a review of Nakla Fruits Flavor. I think this is mixed fruits. Um, I'm not sure. It just says fruits flavor on it. Um, got it as a free sample from hookastore.com. Um, yeah, there's a contest going on on Hookapro if you didn't know. Uh, Sorry, my brain's not quite here today, so I'm going to do the best I can. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's take a look at the smell and consistency of this stuff. Alright, your consistency, it's Nakla. There's really not else much I can say because Nakla, it's all cut the same. It's all exactly the same as all the time. It, they don't change. It's, you know, if you never smoked Nakla, it's kind of chunky, uh, looks like a cross-cut shred. It's not real moist, like you can actually see the clumps of tobacco, and there's not a lot of juice in the bottom. Uh, of course, uh, we've come to notice that anything that comes in a jar or a can is a little bit more juicy than what comes in a box. Uh, don't know why that is. But, uh, yeah, it smells, you ever had fruit scented air freshener, like just random like mixed fruit or fruit cocktail air freshener or something like that? It smells like that. Um. Like, I can detect, like, real subtle notes of a couple of different flavors. But when they all blend together, it's it's just not really appealing to me. It's kind of a bland fruit smell, which is really weird, because normally the fruit smells are very bright, very obnoxious smells. Um, this one, it's just kind of like, yeah, okay. Um... I've been smoking this for, call it, 45 minutes. My coals are getting ready to die, so I figured I'd go ahead and do the review before they died all the way. Um, yeah. Well, let me purge real fast. Okay. Here's the smoke. Oh, come on. Nope, coals just died, and they burnt the top layer with it. Goody. Okay, that was a really weak ghost of what Nakla smoke normally looks like. Um, yeah. The flavor, the entire way through, like, when I first started the bowl, it was kind of like, and this could be good, but we're going to have to see what it's like when it, you know, warms up. I ended up having to stick my wind cover on with three Seashiko coals on a Vortex bowl because, like, I just was not getting enough heat or something. It really, you couldn't taste anything. Um, it stayed about the same for a while. It It's kind of like... Hey, we're fruit in the background, but it's like one of those. I'm trying to figure out how to explain it. Okay, you know that friend that you you need them from for some stuff, but you don't like to have them around, and it's really annoying when they start bugging you about something. It kind of tastes like that. <laughs> I don't know if that made any sense. Um, like.
It's not a flavor I'd smoke voluntarily. If one of my friends wanted to smoke it, yeah, I'd probably make them mix it with something. But uh, th it's not a it's not a whack me in the face and go, whoa, that's cool flavor. This it might be for the more traditional people because I'm sure this is like a more traditional flavor. Um, but to me, it's just not good. It tastes bland. It tastes boring. There's really, like, I kept smoking it simply because I thought it was going to get better, and it never did. Um, yeah, that's about all I can say about it. The cut, it's not the standard. The smoke was not the standard. The smell, fruit flavored air freshener. The taste, not much better. Um, yeah. I'm going to give this a 4 out of 10, because I really did not like it. I don't know if it's the batch I got or what, though, because I know some people like it, but it's just... Uh, let me see if I can find a date on here. No date? No date. I guess not. I don't know. I don't know when that was uh, manufactured. So, you know, it could be old. It could be a bad batch. It could be that, you know, I just didn't get the heat right today or something. But it, not a good smoke. Just not a good smoke at all. Um, so, yeah. Four out of ten. I wish I could give it more, but it just was not good. So, uh, Nakla Mixed Roots, 4 out of 10. I thank Hookah Store for the uh, free sample, though, because, you know, this is one of those flavors that I might not have actually bought to try. It's one of those flavors that I kind of looked at it and I went, huh. So I appreciate them giving me the chance to try it and everything, especially with this contest going on. Um, so yeah, but, I don't know, yeah, that's all I got to say, so, uh, go to hookahpro.com, check it out, it's the ultimate source for everything hookah, go to hookahstore.com, they're one of the greatest vendors out there, um, they're sponsoring a contest on Hookah Pro right now, where you can win one of eight Khalil Mamun hookahs, that's just freaking awesome, so, um, yep, Alright, I'm Freddy Kitsune coming at you from hookpro.com. Peace.